Hi everyone, welcome to Mariness. I'm Ashma and in today's video I'll be reviewing for you all the Stay Quirky I Love You Too Kajal. Now many people have raved about this product and I wanted to try it for myself. So as we all know Kajal is something which is really important for every girl. If you wear it daily or even if you wear it on special functions, this is something which does not complete a makeup look and for that reason a Kajal should fulfill certain criteria I feel personally before we buy them or indulge in them. So in this video I I'll be showing you all all the aspects about this particular budgeted kajal and before we begin that if you are new to my channel don't forget to click the red color subscribe button along with the tiny bell icon next to it to receive updates of all my new videos so now let us get started so this is how the kajal comes like in a soft cardboard packaging and all the details about it are mentioned behind and as you can see here that the price of this one is rupees 199 for 0.35 gram product by, but i got it for 139 rupees on purple.com and the manufacturing is uh, august 2018 and it is best before 2021 and the kajal was uh, made in germany and uh, they have also mentioned here on the packaging that it is much proof dermatologically tested and it is water resistant on their website also in the product description they had mentioned a few claims which said that it is much proof waterproof transfer resistant single stroke application long lasting non irritating it is vegan and it gives a radiant finish and lasts up to 12 hours so all these claims will be trying it out and we'll be checking and going thoroughly through it and after that only we'll come to the review so let me just apply this quickly and show you so it glides easily so definitely one stroke application so i'm just going to do some multiple swatches so it's easier for uh, trying out all the different claims so i'm just doing uh, two swatches here and uh, i've not uh, you know uh, opened the tip completely i've just removed a little bit portion otherwise the tip can have a chance of breaking so it's definitely not smudge proof here you can see and i just touch it and it comes out and once you just rub it lightly the kajal smudges all over so the first criteria of being smudge proof is definitely wrong and it is not working here we can see that clearly now we'll also do a water test so i just had this face mist which is over right now so i just filled it with water and uh, let us spray and see if this is working or no so i've taken a lot of water but uh, let's see so on rubbing it lightly the kajal is not coming out right now so i'll use the other finger also which is clean so yeah still not coming out so it's working pretty good and i think it is water resistant and i will not say it is waterproof because if you rub it very like you know a little uh, up by applying a little pressure more then uh, the kajal definitely smudges and it's not waterproof so i even applied it on my waterline and on um, my upper waterline and even as a liner so it worked pretty well and i used it thoroughly for about 12 hours and we'll just see what all difference did it make and how it worked on me now if you have been following me on instagram you must have already seen this uh, kajal on my instagram stories so this is the zero hour look and it was really dark and pigmented and in between 12 hours i've even washed my face once where the color did bleed but it stayed so this is the 12 hour look now coming to my verdict about this particular kajal well i do feel it's affordable at 139 rupees and uh, the packaging is also good where the product does not get wasted so it's very pocket friendly other than that the color is really dark color payoff is good it's highly pigmented it does not cause any irritation it's water resistant and it also stays up to 12 hours which is definitely true to its claim looking at the downside about this kajal well i would have really loved if it would have been waterproof and smudge proof but i think due to its creamy consistency it lacks this particular property so that's all for today's review and if you are interested in this product then i'll put the link of this product in the description tab below but before that let me clear this that this is not a sponsored video and i have bought this product with my own money so i really hope this video was helpful for you all to make a choice and if you like this video don't forget to give a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already it would really mean a lot to me so i'll see you all soon with a new video till then bye bye Take care.